let's talk yoga <clears throat> okay now first I'm a beginner beginner very new yoga student <clears throat> and I teach myself <laughs> yeah me and videos so I started out with Rodney Yi AM yoga and I think it's <clears throat> uh, one yoga for each day of the week Monday through Friday and uh, it's a very good DVD I think for beginners and uh, I think I made a right decision when I started and wanted to get more into yoga because I I'm I used to do Pilates and then I said I wanted to introduce yoga and when I started yoga I fell in love with it uh, it just makes you feel <clears throat> so connected and so alive and so aware of your surroundings of your breath the most important thing to us our breath which we sometimes forget and this teaches us to breathe and to appreciate the breath and <clears throat> if I'm at work or if I'm getting stressed out or overwhelmed and I remind myself to breathe it makes a world of difference you take really deep inhales and hard long exhales and if I'm laying in the bed and I want to sleep and I can't fall asleep I just start doing breathing some really deep breaths and it helped <clears throat> so I started out with Rodney and I wanted to up the ante so then I went I have a bunch of Rodney DVDs but I just brought out the one that I started with and so I went to Trudy Stylers and this is the weight loss yoga and I seriously enjoyed this as well. It's a different style, a different technique, and I love it. I think it gives me, Rodney gives me more of a stretch, and the Trudy Styler gives me more of an intense stretch workout sequence. <clears throat> and as of lately, I've been doing some free flow, which is where I've taken the things that I've learned from my DVD and just move with my body and do whatever feels right to me now <clears throat> pointers that i've learned along the way is do not expect to do the same thing that these professionals are doing on the dvd just try to get your stance correct and try to get your alignments correct that way you don't hurt yourself <clears throat> but do not try to make your head touch the ground if you're not flexible like that yet it takes time because <laughs> I'm not even there and my body is so tight like <laughs> my hips are tight my it's so tight but I realize the more I do the less tight and restricted my body is and now it started becoming a little more flexible and I'm I'm getting a little more adventurous and doing things that I wouldn't normally do because I'm scared to do a headstand and now I'm doing a headstand you know so it's pretty amazing what else can I tell you guys about yoga oh it's it's it just have patience and don't ex don't be hard on yourself you know especially if you're a beginner don't be it's gonna take years to be on their level <laughs> seriously so don't be hard on yourself just go with what feels right for your body and you have to know when it's time to push yourself because if you're doing a move and it hurts you stay in a little comfort zone but a week down the line you're doing the same move bend into it some more and experience the hurt some but not to the point where it's gonna affect you but that that's how you're pushing yourself up 
past your limits because we we have limits that we put our bodies and as soon as we feel like a you know we pull back as soon as it gets intense we pull back it's the same as if i'm jogging when i feel like i'm gonna die and i want to stop and if i push it and say okay i'm gonna run until the next house and then when i pass that house i'm saying i can do it to the next house and <clears throat> eventually you know you pass you pass the pain the pain is numbed and you realize that you accomplish something but yeah i love yoga because it centers me it makes me aware uh my breathing it just i just feel so much in tune with my life and i'm happier i smile more i'm just so easy going and it's a lifestyle and there's different things that you can surround yourself with you can surround yourself with crystals because they are off the earth and i think honestly that they have a certain i don't want to say <laughs> magic <laughs> they have a certain energy that's the word i'm looking for they have a certain energy and if you open your mind to it you'll be able to experience that light yourself a candle meditate i meditate the other morning i've meditated on and off and i can never quiet my mind even when i'm meditating and the other morning i meditate and i really experience what meditation is all about because i was able to quiet my mind and go deep within myself and so it's a lifestyle and it takes time you know start slow and then add on as you go and do what feels comfortable and do what feel right and don't compete with these guys because yeah they're on something else <laughs> and it's gonna take you a while to get there but yes i i think i'm a yoga junkie for life i'm addicted now and i find myself stretching before i go to bed trying to open up my hips more and it's really helped and it it helps with your posture i mean i sit 24 7 at work i'm around a computer and i sit and my back don't hurt anymore like it used to because it helps with your posture it helps you to sit upright and even sometimes i'm at work I will do a yoga pose or a yoga stretch and it's it's a lifestyle and you should do it throughout the day it should always exist and but it takes a while for you to get there but I don't know if I covered everything that you wanted me to on this topic I hope I did if not please ask the questions and I will answer but yeah it's it's joyous to experience this joy by stretching your body and being in tune and being mindful and it just brings this unconditional joy <laughs> but <clears throat> that's it if i have any question let me know and uh if i can i will answer and as i said i'm a beginner i i am nowhere in near as talented and as flexible but i'm a beginner and i'm enjoying being a beginner and learning how to get to the stage that i want to get eventually thanks for watching bye